We are proud to support Maine businesses. Not only are they our customers, they are the lifeblood of our state. Whether they're entrepreneurs who have come here to try to grow a business and make a life, or whether they've been in a sixth generation business in Maine, we're proud of them all. Hey everyone, today our travels bring us to Lubeck, Maine, the easternmost town in the United States and home of the iconic West Squatty Lighthouse. While you take in the magnificent views behind me, we're going to head a few towns over to East Machias, where we will tour coast of Maine. There they take locally sourced residuals like lobster and blueberries to make the richest fertilizer in organic soil for people all over the country to enjoy. Coast of Maine, essentially Coast of Maine organic products. We manufacture compost, in particular lobster compost. When you go and eat a lobster, like you have a lobster dinner, all that stuff that's left on the plate when you're done, that's the kind of stuff that we actually compost here. We bring in an amazing <laughs> amount of lobster shells. Wow, I gotta get closer. Yeah. Smells like the ocean meets the farm. That, exactly, <laughs> that's what it is. The ocean meets the farm. We're taking bucketfuls of lobster shells based on a specific recipe. Over the top there, you can see the top of the uh, uh, sawdust that we use. Mm -hmm. And then the, the backhoe will come in and he will blend those and lay out these windrows. And, and as those heat up, they'll turn them. All that biology that's happening in there, everything's breaking down, so it eventually comes out as plant-ready food. Um, that's what we do better than anybody else. And right now, when you look around, it doesn't look, doesn't look very good, but what's in there really makes your plants grow. We're like a craft brewer, so we have our own recipes. We're using inputs that are indigenous to the area that we're in, and we happen to be world-class composters. We're the microbrew of composting. Who doesn't want to eat Maine lobster or farm with Maine lobster? Exactly. <laughs> That's so cool. So it's pretty nice to have all of these raw materials right local. I mean, that's why, although we're located way out in the middle of nowhere in down east Maine, that's where these materials are. So the lobster, the blueberry waste, and the carbon sources. For us, it's pretty much heaven on earth because we love it here. You have iconic Maine beauty, like bold coasts, rocky shoreline, and very, very few people. So we get, uh, we get the luxury of affording that all to ourselves. <laughs> I love living in Maine. I came here 17 years ago. I rolled into Washington County. I knew I'd never leave. I now live in Lubeck, of course work here, and spend almost four years now. I had already on the side was an organic gardener. Uh, I grew all my own food. I helped start the Lubeck Farmer's Market. So when this job popped open and it w required a technical background, it was kind of an easy fit for me because this was already my lifestyle. And now I get to work my lifestyle. I love what we do. We're taking a marine residual that might otherwise be thrown in the woods and then we're able to bring it back and bring joy to somebody's life. I love the fact that we've got a beautiful image of the coast of Maine on the front of our bags and I think that that impacts people when they see our products across the country and I'm hoping that they have that same response that, that Maine is a beautiful environmentally friendly place not only a, a wonderful place to come to visit, but a wonderful place to come and live. They say, if you love what you do, you never really work a day in your life, and that's kind of how I feel working here. <laughs>